Hey, what's up family? Happy Monday. Today is April 10th, 2017, and this is, I am 10 days into the vlogging every day in April challenge. So I'm super excited and pumped to be a one third of the way done. So today's topic was called guilty pleasures. Um, and so for a lot of different people, guilty pleasures can be a lot of different things. Um, I know uh, depending on what we think about the word guilty, you feel bad for having it or doing it and pleasures, but it feels good when you have it. So in a moment, I am going to share with you one of one of my guilty pleasures. Now, let me preface this by saying that I have been going to this place probably for actually for a long time since high school. I was introduced to this place back in, let's see, high school when I was a junior. Okay, now I will say that I used to be about 350 pounds. And this place was one of those places that literally I would go to daily. So for those of you who know me or who are from the Fairfield area, this place should be very familiar. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take you through the drive-through and I'm gonna order in Spanglish, all right? So don't hate on my Spanglish, y'all. But uh, here we are, Fairfield, California at at Alberto's. All right, so let's show you guys how I get down. Hi, um, can I have a numero 24? And can I have the bacon moderados, por favor? Okay, algo más? Uh, no más. Gracias. Gracias. How do you guys like that? You know what I'm saying? Get my little Spanglish on. So there's a little sign right there at Alberto's. And it's pretty, pretty crazy, because when I think about it, like, the number 24 is one of the most popular burritos, breakfast burritos everywhere. Okay, and I'm gonna show you in a moment what's in that burrito. But what's crazy is that um, everyone knows about the 24, everyone. The best breakfast burrito in town. Um, and for those of you who also know, oh. I laugh, thank you. <laughs> okay, let's just. She kind of looked at me like, hey man, I know you. Why are you talking in Spanish? But you know, that's how I do it. You know, I got respect for my peeps. All right, gracias. All right, thank, thank you. you. Gracias. Brown bag, y'all. Y'all know about that. All right, guys, so I see a lot of this stuff on YouTube. Everyone doing like unboxing of like different digital equipment. So I'm gonna do the unraveling of this guilty pleasure of mine, the number 24. Okay, and so for those of you who don't know, number 24 is a breakfast burrito, okay, from At Alberto's. If you guys can see the label there, it's nice and warm. Right now, I'm gonna roll it out like that. Yep, there it is right there. All right, and I'm just gonna go ahead and cut into that right there. And what the breakfast burrito consists of is, oh, there you go, look at that. Look at those layers, there's some cheese in there, potatoes, a little bit of bacon. Yeah, and, and I know I got a lot of friends and family, I'm vegetarian, vegan, I love y'all to death, you guys know that. Um, but yeah, this is uh, one of my, my guilty pleasures. So the number 24, gotta get the sauce, you know what I mean, the rojo. Get the Rojo sauce going um, from at Alberto's. So this is one of the guilty pleasures that I'm going to be sharing with you today. Um, thanks again, signing out. Don't want you to watch me eat this one, but it's going to be a good one. All right, y'all. See you in a bit. Peace. Hey, what's up, everyone? Now I'm going to show you my second guilty pleasure. We are here. I just ordered a few minutes ago, but now we are going to show you my second guilty pleasure. See if you guys can take a guess. Yep, here we are. Let's see if you can guess what I get from here that is part of my guilty pleasures. All right, y'all, here we go. So, earlier, oh man, stepped on a piece of gum, what the heck? All right, so here we are, I'm out here, parking lot pimping you know not really parking lot pimping but you know what I mean here in the parking lot going old school like how we used to eat back in the days when we tailgate or whatever so as you can see right there yep it is the game changer so let's go ahead and unveil what we have here from my second guilty pleasure okay second guilty pleasure wing stop let's pull this out 
Oh, for those. Oh, you know, those are those fries. This actually isn't my guilty pleasure. These are my wife's. So this is for my boo thing. Babe, got your fries right here. All right, here, the moment you've all been waiting for. What is Ryan's second guilty pleasure from Wingstop? And the answer is, drum roll please. Bum, bum, bum. Yes, there it is, you guys. There it is. Lemon pepper, extra crispy, bone in, all drums from Wingstop. But wait a minute, wait a minute. You guys, we can't just eat this alone. For those of you who know me, I'm Filipino. So what do Filipinos eat with their chicken wings? You guys wanna take a guess? I know some of you guys are thinking, hmm, what do Filipinos eat with their chicken wings? And in the next container, let's see here if you guys can take a guess. You can't eat the wings without, yes, you guessed it right, the rice, y'all. So for my last combo of my guilty pleasures, I have here my chicken wings from Wingstop, extra crispy lemon pepper with my rice. So <laughs> there we go, guys. That is my two of my guilty pleasures, AKA my kryptonite. And man, look at that, gum on my shoe. Put all that gum on my shoe. So anyways, thank you again for tuning in and taking the time just to check my video out and get to learn more about me. So I'm looking forward to seeing all of your videos out there in the YouTube world. Once again, join the tribe, y'all, and click subscribe. Peace, and we out. Remember, realize with your realize. Talking about the eyes of our heart, and your boy is out. Peace.